This is a CCTV video which has shocked Mexico. Inside a migrant detention center, a Mexican official and security guard walk by just as flames take hold inside the cell of migrants locked up under their care. It was a blaze this Monday night which ultimately killed dozens of people, the majority of them Guatemalans. They'd been detained and held in Ciudad Juarez, right at Mexico's border with the United States. President Andrés Manuel López Obrador had said on Tuesday that they themselves had started the fire in protest at their upcoming deportation. But on Wednesday, with the video coming to light, he was forced to confront allegations that his own government's officials appear guilty of the worst kind of negligence, letting people die. There will be no impunity. Those responsible for this painful tragedy will be identified. They will be held accountable and punished in accordance with the law. Later in the day, the Mexican Attorney General's office requested arrest warrants for several people in connection with the fire. In Ciudad Juarez, mourning. And as the names of the dead were read out, calls for justice. Every migrant has the right to be safe, to be protected, not to be mistreated or violated by any authority, because we are not criminals. There have been tensions within the border city for weeks, caused by the large number of migrants and asylum seekers gathered there, some launching chaotic pushes to try to get into the US, disrupting local commerce. While authorities have been accused of using heavy-handed tactics, to round them up and get them out. But this isn't just an issue for Juarez. There are detention centers for migrants across the country. There are just small protests here outside of Mexico's interior ministry, but this has been an issue for some time in the country. Migrant detention centers, which migrants themselves and activists have described as little better than overcrowded prisons. The reality is that Mexico's relationship with the United States depends, in part, on its stopping migrants from getting through and to its powerful northern neighbour. So the detention centres and deportations will remain. But tragedies like this one raise yet more red flags about the attitude and treatment towards the migrants held within them. John Holman, Al Jazeera, Mexico City.